Hello students, in this really short video, uh, I am going to talk about importing the virtual box appliances which I would distribute with some of the videos uh, so that you can try some of these labs by yourself. So we will go to file, click on import appliance, click on open appliance and then wherever you have downloaded any of the OVA files which we have given select that file in this case I am selecting you know the verb tampering one click next you can change the name if you like right uh, as descriptive as you would like it to be click on import and this imports the machine. Now, uh, all of the VMs which we distribute would actually have their network mode set to bridge where you know we would have the still the default interface I had selected while creating them. Now this unfortunately causes a problem. So when you hit start on this specific VM, you'd actually find that we end up getting an error saying this interface is not found which is absolutely fair uh, because this interface was on my Mac on which we created this VM does not exist uh, in your Windows machine where we are now trying to go ahead and run this VM so here is what I'm going to do it's very 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 super simple really click on network and you would notice at the bottom here that an automatic conversion is happening uh, where VirtualBox will go ahead and select one of your network adapters to which the bridging has to happen to and you can select you could have multiple adapters and you can select the one you want bridging to be enabled with that's all right that's all you have to do click on OK hit start and it should start booting in just a bit it would give you some information like you know mouse pointer integration is not there etc that's absolutely fine right the VM I am distributing is so bare bone uh, that unfortunately does not support all that and it needn't as well because this is just a vulnerable box not something you're going to be working in now after this what we're going to do is let's click inside the VM move the mouse pointer around and just go ahead click anywhere system tools can be a little flaky and dodgy select terminal and just type in if config and this would now tell you the IP address we currently have for this specific VM so in my case if you notice the IP address is 192.168.1.8 awesome so using this IP now we can work on different attacks uh, depending on what the VM has packaged right so here's the simple video I'll probably reference this in a lot of other videos about how to use VMs which I am distributing that's all for this video thank you very much